tener el lucro de Ahora. Ay, ok. This is a video update of my research in finding a way to provoke a circular movement using magnets and iron shields. Okay, okay. This prototype is a this prototype. Okay, this prototype have wait, déjame la línea en medio, me Okay, aquí. Okay, this is a, a video update. This is my pro, my lab, laboratory prototype researching a way to provoke a movement, a circular movement using magnets and iron shields. Okay, this prototype uh, have two parts, a rotor and have a stator. In the rotor, there is spiral magnets. It's there, there are four spiral magnets. And this and the spiral magnet move attracted by the shield by this shield. Okay, and it moves from the beginning of the spiral magnet. From the beginning of the spiral magnet, it's gonna move all the way to the end of the spiral magnet through the shield. Okay, in the stator there is a shield that's gonna uh, attract the spiral magnet because the spiral magnet is in attraction mode. Gonna feel attracted to the shield. Okay, there's in this in this concept. This is not a magnet model. This is only a concept to find a way to provoke a movement, circular movement using magnets and steels. Okay. There's four. Okay, there's four of this one. And this prototype, we have four shields. This is the shields that is in the rotor. And four spiral magnets. This is one. <coughs> this is two. And three and four in the other one. Okay, okay. This 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 component is there, there's there's a magnet here, and this this component is gonna provoke a repulsion in the spiral magnet. Okay, when the spiral magnet feel attracted to from to the shield, it's gonna move all the way from the beginning of the spiral magnet to the end. When it gets to this point, and this point is gonna be in this point of the shield. Okay, then, and the rotor, in the same rotor that is the spiral magnet, there's this component that are magnet too, but that is gonna uh, provoke a repulsion to this spiral magnet when it gets to this point. And then, uh, the shield, the spiral magnet are gonna move relative to the shield. The the shield are in the stator is gonna move in one direction, and the spiral magnets are in the rotor are gonna move in the other direction. Okay, I cannot make a demonstration here because I had to make another change. I had to, I still have to do an adjustment in the prototype. That is what, that's the, 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 the issue that I want to speak, uh, talk here in this update. Okay. When the, 
when the repulsion magnet comes to this point, this magnet, the repulsion magnet, are gonna magnetize the shield. And it's gonna magnetize it in with the polarity, same polarity of the spiral magnet. And that's gonna cause a repulsion. And because the spiral magnet are moving relative to the shield, uh, the propulsion effect are gonna be effective and it's gonna continue the movement and the shield's gonna move opposite. But I, that's, that, that all, everything I say is for doing a test. Okay, but now I have to resolve that this shield, the thickness of the shield are made to desviate the flux of the magnet to cause a ma to to cause an, a, a repulsion effect, I had to magnetize these shields, but they are too large and too thick. Okay, now I have to do. I have to arrange, uh, uh, make an uh, uh, adjustment in the shield, and I have to cut here. I have to cut this. I have to cut here and here and here here make a cut and a cut here and I had to take this part out and put there another shear but it has to be more smaller okay a smaller shear from here to here so when the repulsion magnets come through, pass through that point, the shear is gonna get magnetized with the same polarity of the spiral magnet and there's gonna be a major effect of repulsion. But with this shear and this arrangement, it cannot be done because the shear are all uh, the effect that are causing the shield are of desviating the line of flux and 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 it's not getting too much magnetized to provoke a repulsion <coughs> so i had to cut here and change i had to make a difficult uh, workshop here i had to plan i i think i had to buy a, a new tool to make the cut. I have a grindel there, but it's very, the grindel are too fast. And it's very uh, difficult to cut here with the grindel. I can cut it, but it's, 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 it's a hard, hard workshop. I gonna see if I find a very good tool to cut it easy and smooth, like a, a jigsaw, something like that. I had to go to, to the store. Okay, so that, that's the only thing left in these workshops to do to make a, a movement test to see if this mechanism that, I'm, that I told is going to be a functioning, effective, and going to provoke a movement. Okay, so I'm going to take some shots here to see the way I'm going to cut this. To cut it here and here. I have to make a cut here and a cut here and put a smaller shield. And here, another cut, another cut, and put the shield. I have to do that four times here. Because I, I did a test, I put the, the ring here, look at the, this is the ring, but they stick, anyway they stick to the shear. 
because it's a re uh, we need a repulsion here. When when this magnet comes to this area, it had to and this area had to be a repulsion with the shield and the spiral magnet. This is the spiral magnet. Okay. Okay. Ten minutes. 